So the problem says find the dimensional formula of the following quantities and the option D is the coefficient of viscosity eta. For that the relation is given here as force viscous force F equals to minus eta A V2 minus V1 over X2 minus X1. Let us rewrite this expression. So force the drag force F that is equals to minus eta A V2 minus V1 over X2 minus X1. To find the dimensions of eta, let us take everything on the other side and rewrite this expression. So, eta will be equals to f into x2 minus x1 whole divided by a into v2 minus v1. Let us keep the negative sign, though the negative sign will not take part in the dimensions. So, let us rewrite our uh, dimensions for force. So, force will be equals to m1. L1 T minus 2 this is the dimensions of force x2 minus x1 that is the length difference. So, length difference is simply a length. So, the dimensions of length will be simply L1 and V2 minus V1 that is our velocity difference. So, velocity difference is simply L1 T minus 1 meter per second or whatever units we are following for the velocity difference. A here stands for area. So, area of cross section will have the dimensions L square. Let us now substitute these values in the given expression to figure out the dimensions of viscosity. So, viscosity eta will be equals to force. Force is M1 L1 T minus 2 multiplied with the length difference which is a length so, simply L1 whole divided by area which is L2 and the velocity difference that is L1 T minus 1. Let us now simplify this. So, M has only one parameter. So, it is simply M1 L this one and this one will cancel out with L2 and we left with only L1 in the denominator. So, L minus 1 and t minus 2 and minus 1 when t minus 1 goes on the top it will be added so because there is already a negative sign so minus minus will be plus and it will give you minus 1 here so this is the dimensions of viscosity